Dear students from Moldova, my name is Denik Dufek and I'm the Vice Dean of the Faculty of Civil Engineering of the Brno University of Technology in the Czech Republic. I am responsible for international relations. I would like to introduce you to the Faculty of Civil Engineering and I would like to mention the possibilities of obtaining a Czech government scholarship. Brno municipality is the second largest city in the Czech Republic. The Czech Republic is a country with a rich history and lots of beautiful sites. We are one of the safest countries in the world. We are part of the European Union. Our great advantage compared to the Western states of the European Union is that we have relatively low cost of living. The Faculty of Civil Engineering is the oldest and at the same time the largest faculty of the Technical University. It was founded in the year 1899. Our historic faculty campus was built in period 1993-1911, but you don't have to worry, it's not a historical museum. The whole area has been significantly repaired and modernized in recent years. Faculty campus is located close to the city center. And now some statistics. Our faculty attend approximately 3,800 students and we have about 470 employees. We offer study programs in Czech and in English. In addition to the historic faculty campus in the city center, we also have a modern Admas research center in another location. We offer education in bachelor's, master's and doctoral programs. Our academic year begins in September and ends in June. Speaking of time schedule, it is also good to mention the weather. In summer, there is something between 25 and 30 degrees. In winter, it tends to be around zero. A few days a year can be as much as minus 10 degrees Celsius. But Brno is not located in a mountainous area, so snow is not so common in our city. In winter, it snows four times a month, which is just enough to enjoy. We offer following master study programs. Civil engineering, municipal engineering, environmentally advanced buildings, geodesy and cartography, architecture and urban development. You can study these programs in the Czech language. The study program civil engineering you can also study in English. We also offer study in doctoral programs. Doctoral study programs are in Czech or in English language. In our computer classrooms you will find computers equipped with the important software used in construction. Students have the opportunity to obtain students' licenses. For the purposes of preparing final master or dissertation thesis, our students have access to modern laboratories. In addition to the laborator laboratories at the faculty, they can also use the facilities of our ADMAS Research Center. The ADMAS Research Center is one of the best equipped civil engineering research centers in the world. You will find the most modern devices there. It is also possible to carry out construction experiments on outdoor areas there. All important information about studying our Faculty of Civil Engineering can be found on this website. The Czech government can provide students from your country with a scholarship to cover scholar fees and living expenses in our country. The scholarship is awarded for study in master's or doctoral study programs. Civil engineering is one of the fields of higher education that is included in the scholarship program. You can choose whether you will first learn Czech and study Czech for a year or you will directly study in English. The application deadline is September 30. All important information about the scholarship program can be found on the internet under this link. And let me take you outside and show you our beautiful city. So, now we moved out of the studio and I will show you something what we call Brno Factor. Uh, municipality Brno has about uh, 400,000 inhabitants and we have here uh, six public universities and altogether we have uh, 60,000 uh, students in the city. So, as you can see, the city is full of young people having found. And what is also important to mention is that uh, Brno is capital of South Moravia and uh, South Moravia is a part of our country where we produce more than 90% of wine. So 
just behind uh, our city you can see a lot of wonderful wine yards. So, uh, don't forget uh, deadline for application, it is September 30th. So, I hope you will apply and we will see each other in Brno.